the latest from podnews.net. Spotify's Your Daily Drive feature, which gives commuters a mix of their favourite music and news podcasts, has launched in Germany. Podcasts from Handelsblatt, Spiegel, Zeit, Süddeutsche Zeitung and Deutschlandfunk are all included. It's emerged that one of the casualties of Luminary's controversial launch was their chief strategy officer, Joe Perzicki, who stepped down two months after the company launched. His role was replaced by Jeff Saunders, who's also chief product officer. Perplexingly, the BBC has announced that the BBC iPlayer, their TV catch-up service, is being revamped to include podcasts. BBC Radio has not been in iPlayer for over 12 months in the UK. Amy Woods, founder of Content 10X, is launching her first book on October the 23rd. The book is about how to reach more people online by repurposing content. And there's lots of focus on podcasts. You can pre-order now and get extra stuff. Podcast host Fireside has now integrated Headliner into its service, allowing their customers to simply produce social videos for their podcasts. And podcast ads or branded podcasts. Jar Audio, who make branded podcasts, argue for the latter. And thank you to Karen Herr for becoming our latest personal supporter. She's based in Copenhagen in Denmark and Karen owns Pod Consult. We're grateful to her and our many personal supporters for your kind support. You'll be able to support us at podnews.net slash Patreon. And in podcasts today, Borrowed Future is a new podcast from the Ramsey Network, highlighting what they call a massive student loan crisis in America. This podcast series, they say, explores the lies we believe about college. It's already a top 20 podcast in the US. And that's the latest from our newsletter at podnews.net.